Hey guys, I'm Willie. So I want to talk about another bit about myself. First of all, hope you like the hat. Because I am getting like these kind of hats with like a bunch of nerd stuff like, you know, once a week or so. I still got another one. I got four hats and I'm trying to get more and more of the ones I like. I want to tell you a quick story, uh, which is also funny and also pretty much embarrassing to say. Uh, the story is about the time about me and butterflies. When I always visit my dad, always hanging out with my brother and sisters, they live in a small apartment and I always visit. There was a time when I, when I had my phase of like, of, of these butterflies. Now I know it's going to be weird to hear, but I was afraid of butterflies. I know, it's pretty silly and stupid. The reason why I was afraid of butterflies, I guess, when I was little is because they're always flippering always behind me. Every time I look, it's just one in my face. I just start freaking out as a kid. So I always hated butterflies because just the way they always sneak up on me and just how the way it look. Because for me, it's just weird little guys just flapping their things like their body is so much smaller than their wings. And it's like they just go up and up and then they always chase me around and always freak out as a kid. So uh, there was a time where uh, I was just playing around and then there was this butterfly just flapping around. I turned around and saw the last minute of the butterfly just looking at me and just like doing this. And I was like, oh my god! I just ran and ran and I just was doing this. I, I, I don't even know what I was doing when I was doing that. I was flipping out and I could just see my sister Nicole go, ah! One more, he's afraid of butterflies, and then my little brother was like, Are oh, you afraid of butterflies? So every time I see one, and then they see me like reacting to a butterfly, they just laugh, they're like, Afraid of butterflies, what an idiot. I mean, come on, I am the older brother here, older brother of like five siblings, and I'm a scaredy cat, a manly male is a scaredy cat of butterflies for a while. And no matter what color it is, whether it's the beautiful orange or the white, black, whatever, I, as long as you're tiny and have these weird little thing, wing things and go up my face, I always freak out and scream like a little wiener I am. So then the way I pretty much got rid of my fear is that I have to literally just deal with it. So what I usually do is that I always go outside and just, you know, if I see one, I just don't move. I just stay there and just like, all right. I just need to just, you know, ignore them completely and just play along, you know, just go and play. And don't, don't even look at them, just have a good time. Every time they get closer to me and they always seem to follow me, I just flip out and always shake my head. And I just start like getting nervous. And it's funny because even like random people are looking and they're like, wow, he's, he's actually afraid of butterflies, man, what the hell? So one time I actually was trying to catch a butterfly, you know, it, it was pretty much my redemption. <laughs> and then um, it was funny because as soon as it touched me, I freaked out like a girl, you know. So I was just putting my hand out, butterfly was just going around, and then when it touched me, it like turned and then it, like opened its wings. I'm like, no, don't even do that. And I was flipping out again. <laughs> I've been a scary cat for butterflies for a long time. Uh, of course, now I'm not, but. Uh, Eventually, I just, you know, got used to it and, you know, I, you know, can't remind myself, butterflies don't hurt you, they don't bite you, okay, just relax, they're not like bees where you just piss them off and all of a sudden they start stinging you, you know, I was like, they're just harmless bugs that like nectar, they don't eat human flesh, so get over yourself, and I was telling myself that, a bunch of times. Yeah, I was a scary cat of butterflies, but now, but now I am not scared of butterflies. I'm totally fine with them. I, I'm actually more fine with all types of bugs now. Even spiders, I'm like chill with them, you know? So I'm absolutely fine. It's, it's still funny, you know? You're a guy, and of course, if you're a guy, and you're scared of spiders or whatever, that's, you know, that's fine, because spiders are always creepy little jerks. But if you're a guy who has to be very 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 scared of an insect and it's a freaking butterfly you're not a man all right and i definitely went to say as a kid i was not a man i was a little whiny boy and that was uh that was sad but luckily i i didn't have the phobia for a long time so so 
So my advice to you guys is to just, if you ever see a butterfly, you know, and you start to freak out, just ignore them. You know, they're just nature, they're harmless little bugs, and everything's going to be okay. So then you guys don't have to be like me and be embarrassed by your little siblings calling you a loser because you're scared of a tiny, harmless, harmless, simple butterfly. So don't be like me. Don't be like a scaredy cat. And uh, definitely make sure that your little siblings, you know, don't make fun of you because that's even more embarrassing. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching this vlog. If you guys want to hear my embar more embarrassing stories, you can leave a like and and a subscribe. Also, comment about your story of like the most hateful insect you just hate. Even if it's a butterfly, like me, that'd be great, which I doubt none of you will be afraid of butterflies, so I'll be the only loser who's afraid of butterflies. Alright guys, I'll see you guys next time, and uh, you guys have a good day.